welcome back to another mail day video. This one is uh, truly going to be massive. Uh, we've been doing a lot of braking recently, and as you guys know, uh, priority for me is to get the brakes sorted and shipped uh, in a reasonable time, and this is kind of an afterthought. So a lot of this has been piling up for maybe about four or five days, um, and I just haven't gotten to do the video. I kind of like to wait to do the opening until I do the video. So. With that said, um, I think we've got something like 30-ish packages here, so uh, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, so this one's going to be from a break. Now there's been a lot of breaks uh, recently that I've been getting in. Bowman um, is probably the main break that I've been getting in, except that's going to be in this mail day. There, now there's going to be... Um, some NT basketball mail days um, later this week, maybe even as, as early as tomorrow. So I'm looking forward to those as well. Uh, let's see, this one's packaged really well, sorry. There's probably nothing even in it. Oh, it's a redemption. Is that it? Yep, that's it. I got a redemption. It is from Panini One, and it is a rookie patch autograph blue of Debo Samuel. Uh, Panini One must have gotten in a filler for that or something. I'm gonna put that aside and reach out to him and make sure that's mine. I like to make sure, um, as I would for anybody who's in my breaks, I would hope that they would uh, let me know if they got a card that wasn't theirs. I'm going to double check that one. Kind of a weird one to start with, right? But, um, I don't remember buying in directly into any Panini One breaks, that's for sure. Alright, this is a Acuna update. i um, been getting a lot of these. This is a popular card right now to buy and sell. These are roughly about 200 bucks. It's a nice card. We'll take that. Um, that wasn't that wasn't from a break. That was probably from a straight purchase, um, whether it was eBay or Facebook groups. All right, this one. The more I struggle to get them open, the better package they are. Ooh, this is a uh, from Encased. Randall Cunningham. This was a random team's mixer, so they had a lot of different products. Um, Randall Cunningham, number to 25 for the Eagles. Stuff like this and that Samuel, if it's mine, that stuff will just go right to eBay so I can, uh, <laughs> keep buying in the breaks. You know, that's kind of how it, how it goes, right? Uh, here's some cards from a draft. Contenders draft. Here's a Jeff Glandy and a Nate Stanley. So I'm going to the Vikings. Um, not, not, nothing to really get too excited about there. Another break. Yeah, this one I had the Brewers and a random team. The Bowman random teams haven't been treating me very well. Um, Thomas Dillard auto. Aaron Ashby refractor. Actually, three autos in a case. None of them are great, but, um, three autos. I'll take it. Uh, let's keep going here. This is another break. The quantity of mail in this mail day video is probably going to be a record. I'm not sure the quality is going to be there like we've had recently. We'll find out together though. Kevin Newman and an Ozzy Albee is Archive Signature Series Baseball. Ozzy Albee's and Kevin Newman. I know somebody who likes Albee's. All 
All right, this was another random teams uh, break where I had the Dodgers. There's some good Dodgers autos in Bowman. Let's see what happened here. Some paper. Dustin May. Gavin Lutz. Some refractors and no autos. So Dodgers in a break. Skunk. Alright, here's another random teams break for Bowman. I was in a lot of Bowman breaks. Ever since I hit that super, I kind of thought I needed to be in more, but I don't think I got as lucky in any of them. This one I had the Blue Jays. I think there's a, yeah, Groshans to 50, Gold Shimmer. I have the Indians. Oscar Gonzalez, base auto. And I had the Diamondbacks. Nothing to see here. Bowman's been kind of rough other than that one super from the last video. This one I ripped open just to make sure it was cards, which it is. It's coming from uh, Singapore. This was something I bought on eBay. Um, it's three cards. It's Top's Finest Refractors. This was during all the hype around Jordan and Pippen and everybody. Um, I bought this Jordan Sterling, and these were cheap enough, I'll probably send them to PSA still, even though it's way past the hype of that stuff, and then there was a Rodman too, um, but that came, that probably took two months to get here from Singapore, here's another break. Another uh, Bowman break where I had, this one, must have been a one or two box break. And one box break, maybe you get two teams. Cheap enough to get into, chance to pull a monster. Another Dillard. Looks like my uh, Brewer's Dillard PC is growing. <laughs> I don't have a Dillard PC. I do now, I guess. Alright, this one is from a purchase. Well protected. Yes, there we go. That's a nice one. Nice five hundred dollars ion. I need to sell some of these. I was getting an NT breaks, and that's expensive. So I gotta sell some of my Zions. But that's they're easy to sell. People are people are after those five six hundred bucks. Depending on where you're selling it. All right, another break. And another Bowman break. And another not so hot. I had twins, it looks like, too. Nothing to see here. Uh, Damon Jones, purple, refractor auto. This is another break or a couple breaks uh, within a couple days of each other here, I think. Oh yeah, here's my burrows, so okay. Bunch of different breaks here. Did I get anything in here? Yeah, this is a decent card. I'll send the PSA. Uh, Julio Rodriguez Bowman Mega Box. Um, T. Higgins. I wonder if there's burrows all in the same. 
And the Jared Kalenic mega box. So Kalenic mega box and Julio Rodriguez. I probably spent 15, 20 bucks to get in that break. So I'll take that. I'll look at these others later. I should have got quite a few burrows, I think. Yeah. I'll probably sell these as a lot on eBay. Or maybe grade the draft class and game day ticket ones. The stuff that came back from prison of his has been hot, but I don't know if I have time to grade his, um, grade some of these and, and then have time to get them back before there's other products that are out with him in a pro uniform. Because once that happens, these, these are no good. So once the pro products come out certified, uh, and then some of the better ones, gold standard, you're not going to really see the market for his college stuff. I just got to keep uh, keep moving those as I get them in. That's for sure. Ah, oh, here we go. Uh, ja Morant Blue Re Reactive Mosaic. It's actually, is, I thought it was really cheap, but it's actually not that expensive of a card. 100, 150 bucks, maybe. Something like that. It's a nice looking card. Mosaic's hot right now. Probably flip that as soon as I can. All right, more breaks. The break mail days are the interesting ones because they're really hit or miss. We don't need to do much to get into more breaks. So in some cases, this doesn't look like there's, there's a Nico Horner orange rookie, a couple Nico base, nothing much to see there. Uh, let's see here. This has been a purchase. Maybe I should have sorted the breaks from the purchases and done two videos this time. So this is going to be quite the mail day. Christian Robinson, I've been looking for him. I got a bunch of them already. It's about a two, two, two fifty right now, maybe for this one. They were as far up to like three twenty-five, and PSA is to four hundred. That's what I'm banking on them getting back to their peak. But now with baseball not playing and the prospects, especially not playing. Um, this has been really frustrating for a lot of my PC. Um, just the prospects aren't playing, and they're not, and that's what I loaded up on before the season. So, All right. this looks like it's going to be a Bowman. Um, box. I think I had a personal box. Um, Obviously, I won't go through all of this. Uh, the peanuts are a no from me, dog. <laughs> I hate these things. Okay, that's it. Let me put all this garbage back in here. All right, I think this was a jumbo box. So we'll just look for the three autos here. It looks like base, base, base. Well, maybe it's two jumbo boxes. Dillard again, my boy. Some rookies. Hey, there's Dominguez. Vidal Bruhan. Bruhan base auto. And a Joe Gnord. Atomic. Then a Joe Ryan, Lionel Valera, number to 299, Speckle, and a Tony Drabel, Yellow Auto. So nothing, nothing crazy here, but there were personal boxes, and the one I didn't get had the Dominguez Auto to like 499. So what are you gonna do? All right. Uh, I think we're done with those. Let's see here. This is going to be another purchase, I believe. Should be a Zion, maybe. I 
think this is a Zion base. Or it was before I ruined it trying to get the tape off. Yeah, Zion base. Probably a nine. I mean, that's the only reason people sell them raw, right? This is a six hundred dollar card, PSA ten, maybe four hundred with the right grades and BGS. Nobody's gonna sell it raw for one sixty and have it be in perfect condition. So it's all right. I'll send it off for grading anyway. All right, another break here. Let's see, I don't know. The breaks didn't seem to do so well for me in this video. Oh, come on. There we go. Cubs, uh, El Zole, let's see here, nope, not even a top loaded card, that's not good, and just a speckle Braylon Marquez, so, nothing to see here, what do we got here, um, that might be, Something we look at later. There we go. Another Christian Robinson. This one's probably more closer to the 300 range because of the subgrades here. 9595959510. So we'll take that. Not bad. What is this? More Bowman that I didn't hit anything in, I'm sure. Mets. And Tigers. Hey, there's a Ronnie Mauricio gold auto. Might get me my buy-in back for these breaks. These two, at least. What do we got here? <laughs> It's a theme in this one, and it's not a good theme. The last video we had the Super Fractor, and in this video we got Bichette, a bunch of bass. Bichette. Okay. No autos in this one? I thought I had a Vlad auto. Nope. So just lots of Blue Jays. That might have been two cases or something. Oh boy. The sign feels about like the quality of this uh, mail day. Not great. This is just paper, it looks like. Oh yeah. That's just paper from a break. There must be another one. Yep. This is from the same breaker. Yeah, here's all the hits. So they, he must have just wanted to save on shipping. I had Yankee Yankees by the box in this one. Uh, Duran, Otto, Dominguez to $4.99. I wonder what that does. Blue paper? Eh, 100 bucks maybe? There's a bunch of Dominguez uh, paper base, refractor, Clark Schmidt refractor. Dominguez Atomic, there's a nice card. And Dominguez Chrome. And then I had the Royals too. And that was super depressing. There's my wit. <laughs> it's 
probably some paper, but man, that's not the way to go. This is from another failed break. It's literally just chrome cards from Diamondbacks. Here's some score that I was in just to try to get a, uh, a Brady auto. Oh, and here's some Yankees from Bowman. Okay, there's some Domingos. I gotta start sending all my Domingos in. Alright, two left. Let's see what this is. last one I think is NT, which I was probably going to have some more NT later uh, later this week, but we'll, we'll start off the National Treasures mail day. I don't know, this wasn't, this was a full case serial number break, where I had the number one, so of course I got all four of the printing plates. Haywood, Nowitzki, Bradley Beal. This was not a good break, although I did get a LeBron one of one printing plate, which might go for uh, several bucks. Not anything near the buy in. Lenny Wilkins and Christian Leitner, yeah. <laughs> There's going to be some better hits from NT. I did okay. Um, coming later this week, maybe, but yeah, NT basketball is so expensive for what it is, and sometimes you just, I mean, this LeBron is maybe a couple hundred bucks, but, all right, that's it for this mail day, it's quite a, uh, mix of cards, the purchases obviously were the better cards, the breaks, not so much this time, but, you know, we know that varies, it always has, um, anyway, thanks for watching, guys, I really appreciate it.